I'm having some breakfast, having some wheat bigs and banana. So, good morning everyone. I am not feeling the brightest this morning. But I've been having a shower. I had some breakfast and trying to just feel the best I can before I make a decision about today. Athena and Harry are going shopping, so as you guys know, I'm not really into shopping. You are invited. I know I was invited. I'm not really into shopping these days though. Like there's nothing that I want or need from the shops. <clears throat> I mean they're probably the same kind of shops we have at home, but I'm gonna have a look at the shopping centre and see. If there's anything. Maybe the shopping centre in the whole of the southern hemisphere. When I don't feel good, that's not a great thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a winning endorsement. It's a, it's a cool thing. You gotta say you've been there. Oh, yeah. <coughs> My attitude to shopping is not what it used to be. I'm gonna have a little look at the shopping on the website anyway to see. And then see how I'm feeling. I'll make a decision. Mainly because I know they're probably gonna be there for a number of hours and I don't know I can do not even a half day shopping. Might be a bit ambitious, especially when I'm not feeling the most amazing. But I'll say I'll have a look and I'll, then I'll decide after my breakfast. Okay, I've checked out the um, the stores and there's a few stores I'd like to go to. Like they have a Bath and Body Works, which I know in Australia is very, very overpriced. And I probably wouldn't buy anything considering I'll be going to one in America in I don't know, the end of the year. <laughs> and I don't really need anything. It'll be nice to go and visit again. Um, but I'm just not feeling amazing. I don't think it's a great idea. Um, I know why the kids can just do what they want to do and they don't have to worry about me. Um, yeah, I just don't feel amazing. And just to, I don't think it's worth making an extreme effort for shopping. <laughs> um, and maybe I'll actually go another day and just have a little look around, but this, I probably wouldn't bother. There's just a few stores I wouldn't mind going to, but nothing that makes me think have to go. Like it's in, in America, there's our new shops, whereas these are all shops that we either have a lot we have in Wollongong or up at Miranda or in Sydney, like if I really want them, I can get to them. There's, I think maybe Bath and Body Works is the only one I came across that I don't have easy access to or, or reasonable access to. So, and I don't need to go because <laughs> I had to go to what's in America. So, yeah, I'm just going to hang here and just... um. Maybe I'll educate some groceries later on. I feel, hopefully I'll feel better as the day goes on, but just at the moment I'm not brilliant at all. So I will just relax this morning or until they come back for mid-afternoon or so. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's my plan. Not sure if I showed you guys outside yesterday or not. A bit nice now with some blue skies and fast moving fluffy white clouds. I'm just having some Amy's soup for lunch. It's the um, split pea soup, I think. So it's going to have that. I'm sorry the lighting's so bad again to stand the kitchen. <laughs> um, it's not been the most riveting first day of holiday, as I said. I think I've said this before. This is more for Athena to be with her friends. This holiday is not about me. I'm here just in support of Athena in case they need me. Although it seems like I'm more needing to be supported, not really. Um, I made the right choice not going today. They had a really nice day out and they were gone for, I don't know, four or five hours. I couldn't have done that, especially the way I was feeling. Of course, mid-afternoon, I was feeling a lot better, but I've got a really, really bad back. I just spent most of the afternoon and even just before I got up to do dinner, lying on the bed because my back is so sore. Um, the couch is not very comfortable. And yeah, so I'm lucky I brought my heat pack with me because I've been using that. I'm going to heat it up again once I've finished cooking some sweet potatoes for dinner. Um, I didn't really know what it felt like from what we had, so i just just cooking a sweet potato now and I'll just probably put some um, vegan butter on it and that'll be dinner. That's fine. And what does I, there's not a lot. My choice is, yeah, I didn't really have a lot of choice, so. And I had the quinoa and the the kitty was last night, I wasn't really feeling like them again tonight. So, anyway, I have my sweet potato, that would be nice. I couldn't bake it, well I could have, but I haven't got any baking paper. I think there's going to get some tonight for me. Um, I don't think I can do yet, let me just check. No. Um, this one, maybe. 
Ah, uh, yes, I don't have any baking paper, and the the um everything lo looks like the the um oven's barely being used, <laughs> so I don't want to have to try and clean uh, the the baking sheet, baking trays, and stuff. There's not a lot of stuff here to clean with. Like, um, luckily, I actually bought my Norwex cloth. I'm getting a bit sad, aren't I? I actually bought my Norwex cloth, thinking more for wiping down. I use this for at home, for wiping down surfaces. But we're using it for washing up because all there is is the chucks here anyway. Like, it's not even a scrubbing brush or anything. So to try and get the tray clean could be rather difficult. So I'll just go with sweet potatoes. And. Um, yeah, so I've spent, as I said, I spent the afternoon reading and Thena and Harry were here for a little while this afternoon before they, I went back out again. So I was having a chat with them for a while. So it's actually been a nice day. It's just been a nice chill day. Once I sort of felt better anyway. It's, it's been an okay day. Just my YouTube. Yeah, and I said, I've some reading. Finished the book I started last night and <laughs> started on another book. I did come away with 10 books on my Kindle. No, I've got more than that. I had 10 books from Kindle Unlimited. And I had a few extra books. I've got like 12 or 13 books. So plenty, I like to have a bit of choice. Because <laughs> I don't know quite what I'm going to feel like reading. <laughs> Even though they are all romances and that's what I like to read. Um, oh, and I've got a Disney book too. A book on Disneyland. And a, one, another travel one too. So it's two travel ones, I think. And then the rest are pretty much romance books. That's it. I thought I'd just update you on my afternoon i can't remember when i spoke to you guys so anyway yeah <laughs> haven't seen much yet <laughs> i mean i've been to melbourne lots of times and we were here what last november and we saw a lot of melbourne so if you come to see some melbourne from this vlog and um you might want to check out melbourne my vlogs from melbourne last year but I'll, I'll link them either up here or in the description so you can go and check those ones out because we certainly did a, a bit more stuff that trip because that was a tourist trip <laughs> but I've been to Melbourne many many times over the years so I've done a lot of the touristy things and um, yeah last time the kids sort of did, I sort of did, did what the kids wanted to do um, this trip is what Athena wants to do what Athena and Harriet want to do so anyway hopefully tomorrow will be a better day for me good morning everyone unfortunately I'm not feeling great again this morning so I'm opting to stay home again because I feel like a museum trip in a city is a bit too much for me to commit to. And it's a bit frustrating because I'm sure I feel better after lunch, but well, I hope I feel better after lunch, but I don't think I couldn't handle walking around at the moment. So unless I feel better in the next hour, I'll be having another lazy day at home. I will try and get, if I do feel good, I'm going to try and get out and go for a little walk around. I don't think there's anything here to see, mind you, because we're kind of in an industrial area watering on the campus. So I don't really think, I don't look at the map, but I don't think there's anything besides like streets. But that's okay, I'll still go for a walk if I can. Just to see, see how I feel a bit later on. Thought I would do a midday check-in. Well, it's lunch, it's one o'clock, but anyway, middle of the day check-in. As soon as that she only just headed out, they weren't feeling great either today. So I opted to have like a bit of an easy morning. And then her and Harry are now going, Athena and Harry are now going to catch the train into Wollongong and go and do some more shopping. And she wants to go and visit Dangerfield, which is a very cute clothing store, and Daiso, which is a kind of a, it's a Japanese kind of cheapy junky shop. <laughs> um, I still don't feel great so I didn't really want to be trudging around shops particularly when I don't want to buy anything myself like just having a browse I didn't really appeal at all when I'm not feeling great I'm still I thought my I was because my headaches are better I ended up taking some panadine but I'm still very achy in my arms and legs and my stomach's still a little bit unsettled so just not having a great day a great time of things with fibro but anyway, it's okay. It's not too bad. I've just been watching YouTube this morning and I'm going to read this afternoon. I'm just having some lunch. I just made um, it's a spinach wrap. And what have I got on? I've got some of the aioli, um, some veggie delight slices, which is um, kind of like fake chicken slices. It's very like the veggie roast, which I like, and it's probably almost the same because it's the same brand. 
and some tomato and lettuce so that'll be nice i just have that um we don't as you know we don't have a lot of choice so it's just like what i can put together from what we have that'll be fine and then yeah i'll probably go lie back down on the couch again and do some reading my back's a bit better because it has spent the last few hours on the on the bed lying on the bed it's much more comfortable for me it's just a bit cold in there that's the only thing no, i don't really want to get in the bed i don't know i don't know why they just seemed a little bit too indulgent i guess to be in bed during the day i mean i'm really only lying on the bed because it's a lot more comfortable for me at home as you guys know i just sit on my couch because it's comfortable but anyway um hopefully tomorrow I'll i did get dressed today um i'm just in very comfortable clothes but i did actually get dressed and i'll still see about that walk outside <laughs> but um yeah at this stage no but we will see it's frustrating and disappointing not to be feeling that good but it's also okay as well good morning everyone and yes it is indeed a good morning you can probably tell i've got some makeup on and i am dressed i still gotta finish my hair <laughs> i'm still gonna blow dry it but i am feeling so much better probably helps that i woke up at 5 30 to my medication then and it's now i don't know 9 30 10 ish I'm not sure what time it is but yeah so I took my medication many hours ago and I think that's probably been the best thing. Let's wake up, have my medication and I read for a bit. And then I actually went to sleep and I didn't get up again until 9 o'clock. So it must have been like 10. Anyway, yeah, I woke up until 9 o'clock. I went to sleep and obviously need a bit of extra sleep. I've not been sleeping the best here, kind of tossing and turning quite a lot. So I know I'm not getting quite the sleep I normally get at home. And I'm pretty sure I don't toss and turn at home. But anyway... Um, so today we are going to the Melbourne Museum to go to that Viking exhibition and that's kind of what we're doing today. I don't know how I'm going to go walking around a lot but I will just go do what I can and then just find a seat if I need to find a seat and sit and people watch or whatever. But, um, just do what I need to do I guess. We're going to drive in so and we're only planning to be there for like, probably like four hours or something, three hours, I don't know. Probably too long for me to be walking around all that time but I said I'll just do what I can and if I need to sit many because I know I'm not very fit and I haven't obviously done hardly anything what the last three four days I haven't really done much so three days what day is it Wednesday so four days I pretty much sat on my backside most of the time <laughs> so yeah we'll just see but I'm glad I get to venture out and um actually show you guys some of Melbourne <laughs>
use is a fire lap. Um, there he is, famous Australian racehorse. Very exciting stuff. He's really big though, look at how big he was. I don't know what the, the costume from Animal Farm.